Hello, Forecaster here again, and we are back for episode three of the Railcraft Patron Server Let's Play. And I just found a kind of a desert area, and I'm grabbing some cactus, obviously. There's some beehives around. Um, we've settled in the village we found in the last episode. Ooh, I found a dungeon as well. Uh, it looks like it ma it's made out of sandstone. Oh, oh, Bex, you need to come here. You have absolutely no idea. Come here. Come to the uh, the red sand desert. I have something to show you. This is, this is too amazing. Come here. Uh, you almost walked past me. Well, I guess it doesn't matter. There you are. Come this way. This is great. And I'm sure you'll see it once you get close enough. We need to make an atlas, by the way. Yeah. I thought you might say something like that or react in that manner. Isn't this great? This place? Yeah. Ow. What? Oh. Did the bees sting me? Probably. God damn it. Or maybe it was lag and cactus combined. I don't know. And then there's the dungeon over there. Are actions local? Actions should be local, right? Because they aren't shouts. I also happen to know that they are not sent to Discord. Well, that's not necessarily a bad thing. Oh, look over there. There's a plateau with a tree on it. Two trees, in fact. Yeah, another one. Yeah, this was a pretty good find. Yep. Like a pine forest over there. Some sort. But yeah, this has been pretty great. Lots of bees around here as well. Which is 
good. All that's missing is that there's uh, like an iron mine right under here somewhere. And there might be. Who knows? I do intend to um, start a mine. Question is, where exactly? I guess having it under the, or having the entrance in the village somewhere would be the most practical. Could have the tunnel in one of the buildings so it's kind of sheltered or the tunnel entrance that is obviously um, probably want to make a furnace so we don't or did you make one of those yet no you don't have one of those yet there's that um, script error again it's bound to get dark soon once again so I'm going to collect some cobblestone from out here and make a couple of furnaces Yeah. Oh, hello. There's a villager in our house. Okay. Apparently I had enough for just one furnace, but... Ah, uh, well. Let's put them over here. Um... I still don't have an axe. not great you get some of the reverb from that sound mod between these it's kind of cool I also need to install uh, better foliage. Oh, there's a farm here. Did you see the farm? It's right by the um, Railcraft hut. Got tons of wheat. Which is great. I'm going to place some torches here. Did we have a mod that made it so that um, crops only grow in sunlight? I don't remember. It's difficult to remember all of these, all of the mods we have, and what settings we are using. Yeah, sun's almost setting. 
probably going to need to seek shelter soon. Oh, there were two farms. One. Ah, there's actually quite a lot of farms. That's good, I suppose. All right, let's hide in here. Um, do we want to make some bread? Let's see what we can make with wheat. can make flour which you can cook I think we should disable the um, the wheat to bread crafting recipe so you have to make flour first doesn't don't we have dough isn't doesn't Pam add yeah it does Pam adds dough, which requires salt and water as well. And then you cook dough to make bread. Some There's a mod that adds um, a recipe for flour directly to bread. Probably want to disable that as well. I think. Um... Or put that in the next pack update. It will probably be either later today or tomorrow, so we get the uh, the infernal infernal mobs adjustments as well as quickly as possible. Well, yeah, but I still have to restart the server to apply them. And might as well re release a new tag. So, um, actually, I guess we don't have to do that. I need to implement the uh, critical and non-critical update system to have non-critical tags that don't require client updates and then critical ones which are client updates. Hello Weaponsmith. I uh, can't push mobs around anymore. Tigerwood is tigery. It's like a combination of um, birch, oak, and uh, spruce, I guess, or the colors. Yeah, mine's probably a good idea. Although I hear they are useless currently. Oh, hello. Got a blacksmith in here. Or a weaponsmith. Yeah, um, let's uh, let's make a door for this building, and then make the mine entrance in here. Because why not? Uh. Maybe we want some ladders as well. 
Although I can just as well make a staircase for now, I guess. Uh, what happened to my torches? I was holding torches in my offhand. Did I place? Did I place all of them by the farm? I might have placed all of them by the farm. That is a distinct possibility. I like how people ask, are asking for Y levels when they can't tell what Y level they are at. Because no coordinates. Oh, my pickaxe broke, but I got cobblestone in return. That's great. Wow, this is fast. Does efficiency make pickaxes p faster? Yeah, that is what it does, isn't it? Thought it was something to do with... Uh... Actually, I don't know what I thought. Ah, well. Uh, I ran out of torches. Oh, there was one in the stairway um, I think I'm going to stay here actually Just don't want to go outside yet fertile soil um, okay you do that. Uh, no, I think I want to continue down. Well, I need more torches. Otherwise, it's going to be dark in here, and mobs are going to spawn, which is not, not good. Uh, but I can't go get more torches because it's dark outside. Maybe I want to put up walls and light up the village. So we can move safely within it. It'd probably be a good thing. Gold gears. Do they have a use? No. Apparently, gold gears are completely useless. At least until... We add a use for them. Or something comes along that does. Um, but yeah, once again, it is night and not much to do. I have four coal and four charcoal. Now I have a wooden axe, which is better than no axe. Actually, I could have made a cobblestone one, I guess, but oh well. 
Um, let's try this with an X for once. Oh. Okay then. I should probably make a stone one right away then. There we go. I can probably use this wooden one as fuel. to make more torches. Get more sticks as well, which is nice. Ah, oh, it broke. Um, do we have recipes for the, the cutting machine to do this? If not, we need to set that up. something we have to put on the to-do list. Uh, let's see what J.I. says. Yeah, the block cutting machine has planks and sticks. The ratio is one log to six planks and two logs, or two planks to six sticks. Which I think is, is fine. There are a lot of mobs outside. And all we can do is wait, as usual. Um, I guess we're going to get some metals and try to get started with the IC2 basics, like getting some basic power generation going and an electric furnace and all that. And then the get to the higher tier machines as we go as one does uh, probably want to get some get a foundry going as well which like we saw earlier is going to require a server update because it's currently unobtainable but we'll probably have that done by the next episode so we can look at that I do have a couple of yes and crag rock. Uh, we might want to make some drawers. We could use one for uh, coal and a couple for dirt and s cobblestone and such. Also hopefully we will find a few diamonds, maybe some emeralds if they happen to spawn here. Yeah, probably have drawers for uh, at least for the the coal and such. Probably want full drawers for the stone, at least. Because we'll probably collect a lot of that, I imagine. Uh, let's have a look at foundry. Foundry, we need a burner heater, and that takes copper plates and bronze plates. 
Uh, we need refractory clay, so we need to find clay. And then the basic melting crucible takes refractory bricks, copper plates, and the bronze cauldron. Right. Uh, juicer. Is that the... The Pam thing? Oh yeah, that. That's good. Uh, we should also probably get a kitchen... Going. The kitchen stuff. That should be a more attainable goal because it's probably mostly wood, I think. Uh, let's see. Cooking. The block heads. Did someone adjust this, actually? Uh, the recipe book. Yeah, the crafting book is disabled, so that got sorted. The cooking table is just a some wood a book and some black hardened clay. That should be pretty easy. And Dawn is dawning. So I should be able to get back to the mine soon. Um, I'll put the juicer in this chest here. Ah, I could use another sword because I lost mine. Uh, I need some more planks for that. Just can make sticks. Put the excess sticks in the chest. Um, is it raining? Or is it just storming? I guess it's not raining since the mobs are burning. Although there is a zombie right outside our door who isn't burning, probably because there's a roof above him. That works. Oh, tons of skeletons. Yeesh. There are two of them. I hate skeletons. And a witch. Whoops, sorry. Nice, got the witch. At least the spiders can't get in here. Oh, we have an infernal mob. It's a zombie. I don't know what it is. Well, It's a little weird that sunglasses make mobs immune to fire, or immune to the sun. It's a strange phenomenon. Got a 
gold armor. And I'm practically dead. Whoa. I can't tell what this thing is. It's the health bar doesn't, ah, of course. Do you want to make a hole in the floor? for it while I distract it. Nice. But the regenerating zombies. I guess it will despawn eventually. Could we suffocate it? Probably not. I have one block of sand. There's more out here, so let's get another one. Life steal. That's great. I wonder what the one up means. Does it mean that you can kill it once and then it'll still be alive and you have to kill it again? Probably. That sounds awful. I don't think this is working. No, it's not losing health. Stupid thing. Just leave it in the hole. Why am I not regenerating? Do you need saturation for regeneration? I guess you do. There we go. Now I'm regenerating. Yeah, I notice. Stupid zombie. Punch him. Stress relief. Or something. Oh, okay. There's a skeleton here by the well. Continue this mine business then. Well, the crack rock goes really deep. I don't think ores will spawn in this, which is unfortunate. Maybe we need to put the mine somewhere else where there's regular stone. Oh no, here's regular stone. Great. Oh, 
Okay, the crag rock is apparently slightly softer than um, the plain stone. That's interesting. Oh, I found iron. I don't know yet. Um, I have nine blocks so far. Full iron blocks, that is. Um, now I seem to have run out, however. I got 13 total. Not too bad. Not a vein, though. I think I just found lead, however. I'm carrying a lot of... No, it's zinc. Found sink. Carrying a lot of junk. Uh. Alright, so we've gone a bit over time, so I'm going to end the episode here and probably spend some time fixing some issues with the server, like the whitelist thing, for example. Um, and maybe do some updates. So, with that, we will see you next time.